If you're looking for a feel-good film, this is not it. Mother takes a deep dive into the world of mental illness and toxic relationships and how it affects those closest to you. Although I really like the film, it is not an easy watch in any way, as the director does an amazing job of placing you in the shoes of the mother in a very realistic and claustrophobic way, making you feel suffocated throughout the whole ride. We're taking a long her destructive journey as you watch her spiral out of hand and there's nothing we can do, just like her kids. The saddest part of the film is watching the kids go through all of the experiences, from domestic violence to crime, but still loving her mom, as that is the only thing he ever knew. The mother's performance here is Perfection. The kid also does an amazing job portraying his innocence and being forced to live in a world of not as choosing. Although I first found the film to move at a really slow pace, I realized it does a great job using its runtime to change viewers' perspective on a mother gradually. When I slowed down and reflected on the film, yes, she's a terrible mother, but the director does an amazing job of slowly shifting viewers' perspective and allowing us into her head. There's nothing you can do, but watch it all lead to an ending that will be guaranteed to stick in your head. I really enjoy this film, albeit it's heavy subject. It is a great Japanese film that depicts a world we don't see often. Don't watch this if you're not in the best state.